Hi, let's see like how to fix the network error unable to log in to PlayFab on Texas Chainsaw Massacre. The Texas Chainsaw Massacre is a horror video game that features third person perspective and is based on the iconic 1974 horror film. One puzzling issue is the network error unable to log in to play fab it stops folks from enjoying the online parts of the game the complete error message reads like the network error unable to log in to play play fab this article or this particular video try to explore why this error happens and uh, let's see like how we can fix this Let's see like what causes the network error unable to log in to PlayFab on the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Network error unable to log in into the PlayFab issue in the Texas Chainsaw Massacre can give have a various reasons. It could be because of the PlayFab servers are having the problems maybe from the maintenance or too many people playing. If your internet is not strong or if it is unstable or keeps dropping the game might struggle to connect to playfab causing this error let's see like how we can fix going further so whenever you get this error you will see the screen like this okay so sometimes the firewall or the antivirus settings could block the game from talking to the playfab leading to login issues okay so let's see like how to fix network error unable to log in to play fab on the texas chainsaw -cha massacre if you are experiencing a login issue with the texas chainsaw massacre on the fixes that might help you to resolve them the first method is check your internet connection before making any adjustments ensure that your internet connection is steady and stable any disruption in the network can cause the issues with the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Some of the steps to check your internet connection are turn off your router or the modem, wait for a few seconds and then turn it back on. If the problem persists, you can reset your network settings on your device. Go to the network settings menu and look for the option to reset or restart the network settings. If you are using a Wi-Fi, try switching to a wired connection to rule out any potential wireless issues. Restart your router or a modem to refresh the connection. And the second method is wait for some time, then try again. Sometimes this issue can occur due to a problem with the server of the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. In such cases, it is recommended that turn off your PC or the laptop, wait for some time, then restart it again and then log in again later and the third method is restart your system pc or console sometimes the network error preventing login to play fab on the texas chains of massacre can be temporarily in such cases simply restarting the pc or console can resolve this issue to restart your pc press the windows key to open the start menu click on the power icon and then choose restart from the options after resetting the pc or console check whether the error persists or not some of the steps for the xbox are press and hold the xbox button on the console for about 10 seconds until it turns off wait for a few seconds then press the xbox button again turn it back on some of the steps for playstation 5 Press and hold the power button on the console for about 7 seconds. It will beep twice and then turns off. Wait for a few seconds, then press the power button again to turn it back on. And the fourth method is change DNS. If you are having problems with the game, try switching to the better DNS option. Some of the steps to change the DNS on the Windows, click start and then settings, then choose the network and internet. Under change adapter options, right click on the network, Wi Fi or Ethernet, then select properties. Highlight the internet protocol version, 
4, TCP, IPv4, and click properties. Choose, use the following DNS server address and then enter preferred and alternate your DNS address. Click OK to save. The fifth method is temporarily disable the antivirus or the firewall. Try temporarily disabling the antivirus or the firewall software. By doing this, you can check if the security application mistakenly blocks access to the application or not. To temporarily disable your antivirus software, locate the antivirus program on your computer, open its settings, then disable it. To temporarily disable your firewall, follow the steps, open the control panel, search the Windows Defender firewall or the firewall, select the properties, select the appropriate network profile, choose the option to turn off the firewall for the selected profile. Save the changes and exit the settings. The sixth method is clear the caches of the Texas Chainsaw Massacre for the PC or the control. And sometimes caches stored in the application can get corrupted and can cause the issues with the application. By clearing it, you can remove the corrupted caches and then resolve the issue. To clear the Texas Chainsaw Massacre caches on the Windows, to choose Texas Chainsaw Massacre completely. Press Windows key plus R on your keyboard to run the dialog box. Type percentage local app data percentage, the run dialog box, and then press enter. This will open the local app data folder. Locate and open Texas Chainsaw Massacre folder. Inside the Texas Chainsaw Massacre folder, you should see the caches folder. Right click on the cache folder and then select delete from the context menu. Confirm the deletion when the when it is prompted. Once the cache folder is deleted, you can restart the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. In order to clear the caches on the PlayStation 5, choose the game, go to the PlayStation 5 home screen, select the game, press the options button, select delete, select delete saved game, data, restart the game. Steps to clear the caches on the Xbox, press the Xbox button to open the guide, select my games and apps, highlight the game you want to clear the Cache for press the menu button, select the manage game and add some. Select save data, highlight the save data for the game. Press the menu button, select delete. And the seventh method is verify the game files. When you play games, the platforms usually let you verify if the game files are okay. This can fix the issues caused by the broken or missing files that mess up your game connection. Some of the steps to verify the game files on the Steam. Open the Steam and go to your library. Right click on the Texas Chainsaw Massacre to verify and select the properties. If the in the properties window, select the local files tab. Click on the verify integrity of the game files. Steam will begin the verification process, which may take some time depending on the size of the game and your internet speed. Once the verification process is complete, you will see the result appear in the properties window to confirm the result. Exit the properties window once you're done. Some of the steps to verify in the game files on the Xbox, choose the Xbox series console and navigate to the My Games and App section. Find the game you want to verify and highlight it. Press the menu button on your controller, the one with the three horizontal lines. Select manage and Manage game and adds on from the options in the manage game section. Scroll down and select the manage. They select the general tab and then click on verify game files button. This will scan your game files and then verify their integrity. Some of the steps to verifying the game files on the PlayStation 5 turn on your PlayStation 5 console and navigate to the game library. Find the game you want to verify and highlight it. Press the options button on your control. The one with the three horizontal lines. Select game help and options from the options in the game and the help option in the game help the options menu. Select for the update. This will check for any available updates for the game, which will help you to verify the game files. The eighth method is run as an administrator. When you start the Texas Chainsaw Massacre, make sure to do it as an administrator. This way, the software gets the right permission to work well with the server. Some of the steps to run the Texas Chainsaw Massacre now. As an administrator, lo locate the Texas Chainsaw Massacre client. 
shortcut on your desktop and or start menu right click on the shortcut icon to open the menu select run as administrator from the menu if prompted click yes to confirm the client will launch with the administrator privileges potentially resolving the errors the ninth method is contact Texas Chainsaw Massacre support team. The previous methods or fixes will work for you. Contact the Texas Chainsaw Massacre support team for more help. You can just visit this particular website support.txchainsawgame.com. Uh, they are the experts and they can give you the specific guidance to solve the problem. They are the expertise team. They will particularly check the issue and they will resolve it. Okay. So that's all about this. Thank you.